I just wanted to share with you guys the sheer excitement I am experiencing because I am about to destroy this. Yes! So I know it's only July, but I am already in hardcore Halloween mode over here. I am doing vlogoween and I'm trying to get ready and pre-film some videos for that so I can like enjoy the month and not be so crazy filming. Kenobi, if you eat my food, I swear. You guys have any ideas or things that you would like to see me do for vlogoween? Let me know in the comments down below because we are gonna get the ball rolling on that very soon. Like I'm gonna start filming this week, probably like two videos. Oh, whoa. Hello, little cat. Did you have a good day? Did you do anything exciting? Would you like to be left alone? Okay, good talk. I am currently sitting outside of Joanne Fabric because they sent me a coupon today for 25% off of everything, including the sales stuff, and I'm going in hopes that some of the Halloween stuff is out now. Keep seeing little bits of Halloween pop up at different stores, and you know, craft stores are always like the first places to have that. So we are about to go in Joanne's and see what's good for Halloween. I am so excited! <laughs> All right, it's not that much, but it is a start. Here's what we're working with so far. So yeah, not terribly much going on at Joanne's quite yet, but it's rolling out. It is like early July, so. I will take what I can get. I did purchase, just because I had such a good coupon, um, two of these. I got some lights. I found that we've kind of run out of room for any like big decorations anymore at this point. So lighting is always a good option to kind of like help set the mood a little more for Halloween. I say that now, but watch me buy some big shit like in the next two weeks. So I think if I have time this weekend, I'm gonna go check out Michael's and At Home. Apparently At Home has all kinds of Halloween stuff up. Hopefully we'll be able to check it out this weekend. You know what I don't recommend? It's 90 degrees outside and, and you have leather seats in your car? A short dress. Ow. So today is the day I am going to Michael's and then I'm going to at home to see what is good for Halloween. I asked Chad if he would start pulling all the Halloween stuff out of our little storagey area so I can get the ball going. I am just like beyond jacked up to decorate at this point. Maybe a little too excited. So as far as the Halloween stuff goes, it is the tiniest trickle out. The theme with the craft stores has been so far that a lot of harvest fall things are on display, but not so much Halloween yet. The same with the Joann's. I didn't show you the harvest stuff because it's not what we're in the market for, but every time I see a little pumpkin on the shelf, it makes me so happy. I'm actually the most excited to check out at home because supposedly they have a fair amount of stuff out yet and I've seen online they have this zero from Nightmare Before Christmas that like hangs from the ceiling or wherever you want to put him and he looks so cute and I want him so much so hopefully he's there so I can take home a new pet. Guys, guys, guys! Look! Look it's here! That is not the zero I was talking about, but I love him. Ooh, check out this Maleficent in the corner. I like her. Sorted characters. We have a big ass Jack over here. I don't see zero though. Come on zero, here boy. So they have this big Jack back here and I had to get a picture with him and I totally got busted by some people. It was very embarrassing. Worth it, but embarrassing.
Okay, this is an animated haunted toilet. Are you ready? Here's a surprise for you. Boom! <laughs> hey, someone's in here. <laughs> well, that's embarrassing. Ugh. Oh my god. Why do I want that? I want that so bad. <laughs> This one's very successful. I'm gonna check out, go home, and show you guys all the stuff I got. I'm so excited. So as it turns out, I am the world's worst vlogger. It is a few days later, and now I am finally going to share with you guys all the stuff I got it at home. And this is actually from two different at-home locations because the first one did not have my zero. Don't you worry, he's all mine now. Everything is up, like we are mostly I would say like 75% decorated for Halloween at this point, which I know I'm going to get shit for because it's July, but I don't care. Y'all don't have to live here. I do. And it just takes like so much time and effort and taking things down and putting new things back up. I like redo a lot of stuff in the apartment for it. And so if I'm working this hard, I want to be able to enjoy it for longer. Um, I don't know. I don't have to make excuses. I don't have to make excuses. I'm getting defensive already and off track, but I wanted to show you guys all the stuff that I got. It is just scattered around because our decorations are out. That's what I was trying to say this whole time. Okay, here are the goods. This is not his permanent location, but I did get zero. And he is everything I dreamed he would be and more. Look how cute. Look at that face. I also got this uh, toxic skeleton jar. I don't know. I'm using it as a vase thingy. I liked it because it reminded me of Skelligro from Harry Potter. Speaking of Harry Potter, I found some good Halloween stuff for the Harry Potter shelf too. The lighting is really bad right now and I'm sorry. So hopefully you guys can see it all right. I found this super cute Welcome Muggles pumpkin. And then this little pumpkin right here that says I solemnly swear I'm up to no good. Next to that is a skeleton frog I picked up and then there's a little skeleton spider. Super cute for the Potter shelf, right? I also picked up this little jack-o'-lantern because I liked his face. It reminded me of Nightmare Before Christmas and he does light up different colors. Look at him go! I got this creepy ass witchy looking hand. This pumpkin that is painted with kind of like a galaxy theme. Oh my gosh, over here we have the dinosaur skull. <laughs> He's actually a candy bowl, but that's not what we're using him for this year. And then down here, I'm gonna have to move Indiana Bones for a minute. Is this adorable? <laughs> That's so awkward. This is adorable mat uh, that says monsters are my friends. So I think that is everything that I got it at home between the two days. Uh, like I said, we are like 75% decorated. I have some DIY stuff to do still. Um, that'll probably be in next week's weekly vlog thing. And uh, probably the first video of Vlogoween will be like a full house tour. So if you guys are interested to see like all of the decorations in detail, don't worry, it'll happen. <laughs> but I will be saving that for Vlogoween for sure. So that'll do it for today. I hope you guys had a great week. I was going through my calendar the other day and realized that I have stuff going on for like the next 15 weekends. So um, hopefully the weekly vlogs are a little more interesting than this. You know, if you want to see a little more than me just shopping, there will be other things to do. I'm already tired thinking about it, but I'm so excited. And yeah, that'll do it for today. So thank you for watching. Hit subscribe if you'd like to keep hanging out. And I will see you guys in another video. Bye.